Today I'm showing you my very first order from Sheer Perfection Fabric. And welcome back to Sewing From Scratch. If you're new here, I am Kate, and this is where I share all things sewing related, fabric hauls like you're gonna see today, techniques, tutorials, patterns, inspiration, pretty much everything. I like to consider it like a lifestyle sewing channel, if that makes sense. If any of you follow any lifestyle YouTubers, you kind of know what I'm talking about. If you watch my video of my September makes, you heard that I am now a sheer perfection fabric strike sewist, which is crazy to me and so exciting. It's really been an amazing journey for me to be creative, making things that maybe I wouldn't normally make or putting a little bit of extra effort into places that I normally wouldn't have, like doing appliques. And I've really been enjoying it. So I thought I wanted to do a video to showcase sheer perfection because I am really happy for the opportunity and I just want to pass that love along. So sheer perfection fabric is based out of Saskatchewan and Angela is the owner and she is so sweet. I met her in person and and she has an egg background like I do and she's just really genuine, honest, open and if you follow the Facebook page and you're in the sew and share group you will find things out about her that she's just so true to herself and she will not pass on any sort of fabric that she doesn't think are quality and that aren't up to her standards. The quality of the fabric that I have used has just been phenomenal. I can't wait to hear your guys' experiences. At the time this video comes out, her first round of customs are either in or very, very close to being in and retail is scheduled. I don't want to say an exact date, but once I hear for sure, I will let you guys know on my Instagram page. So make sure you're following me there at Sewing From Scratch 2019. So that is the sports stroke strike and it's awesome. And I think you're gonna be really impressed. So my first order came in and I wanted to share it. There is a website live right now, a bunch of re retail stuff, no customs in yet, of course. There's a lot of notions, there's some Sherpa, pom-pom. She's been bringing in stuff like that just to kind of keep the ball rolling. So you will be able to shop there any day you want. And then, like I said, the first round of customs is coming very, very soon. We're all so excited. And then after that, things will just keep rolling and rolling. So I first wanted to show you the little tag. This is the gift that she gives. If you order from custom groups, you'll know that a lot of them like to give little gifts instead of candy or something like that. Angela chose to do these little tags, which are so sweet and so high quality. I'm really pumped about this. And mine says, this took forever, so you better like it. There's, there's lots of other ones. And she's actually selling these in the shop. Right now, at the time of filming, she's waiting on a shipment, but yeah, you can order like packs of these. So that came in as a free gift. Then I ordered some of the braided suede drawstring and I got white, brown, and black. Super pumped about these. I should have ordered more. I don't know what I was thinking. I just ordered a meter of each and I should have ordered more. I'm excited to use these on some hoodies. You could use them on pants or something too, but I think they will really showcase them, their beauty on hoodies. They're $1.50 a yard, so really inexpensive and they're so cute and they add a lot of dimension to anything that you plan to make. You can get really, really creative with these as well. Love it. Then I got some faux fur pom-poms. So I got them in coyote. I say coyote. Other people say coyote. I don't know. What do you say? Leave me a comment. Do you say coyote or coyote? What? Pass the dumb to a whole bunch of salt. Oh goodness. Not sure if you caught that. My boy just dumped about half a box of salt on the couch. Happy anniversary, mom. Anyway, <laughs> these are the coyote pom-poms. Then I also got them in fox. And these are faux fur. And they're a little more reddy brown, so I'll show you a comparison. This is the fox and this is the coyote. And you can see they are visibly different. Not sure which one I love more. I guess it'll depend on what I match them with. 
and the pom-poms come with these snaps on them so the two parts are there it just unsnaps and then you sew that onto your item so I got two of each these are five dollars each I'll be getting more of these they are so stinking cute and I can't wait to show you what they look like on a beanie I'm making one today Give this video a thumbs up if you love the pom-pom toque or beanie revolution that's kind of become the last few years because they're really popular around where we live. Give me a thumbs up. Let me just talk about the cubby program. So you can start a cubby so you can go shopping and pick out all, say you pick out like a whole bunch of retail stuff or one thing or whatever. You know that custom orders are coming in soon for retail and you want to wait and send it all at once so you can save on shipping. You can start a cubby and it's just an option in your in your shipping payment. I think it's actually the default is add to cubby. So basically it's just a shelf. She gets your order already and puts it there and then she just holds it until you're ready to either check out or to add to your cubby. And the other thing this is good for is free ship Tuesday. So today this video is going out on a Thursday and the last free ship Tuesday is this coming Tuesday that's coming up. So you can shop today or anytime in between buy all this stuff, put it in your cubby, and then you can use your free shipping label on Tuesday to have it sent to you for free. I did add these onto my cubby. They are toggle buttons, and they were $2.50 each. So here's like an inspiration pick of what you would do with it. Plan on using these for a stay cozy jacket from Ellie Mac. You'll probably see it on my Instagram. <laughs> Cute toggles, they're like a greeny, forest green color. Then I got some fabric. I got some stretch leather. So excited about this faux leather. It was $26 for the meter. I didn't realize how stretchy it was gonna be. And it's fleece back, so it's really warm. I am excited to try this on like a whole bunch of things, sweaters, just accent pieces. I thought about making my daughter some leggings. Leave me a comment. What do you think about a three-year-old wearing leather leggings? My husband wasn't against it, surprisingly. So I don't know, leave me a comment. So gorgeous, cannot wait. And then I also stumbled across this Texture Sage color, French Terry. Their French Terry is awesome, loving this. This was a last cut, so it was one and a quarter meter, 1.25 meters for $20. Steel, honestly. And the last thing I got was this Sherpa, Cream Sherpa. This is the only Sherpa they have in right now. It's similar to other Sherpas I've used, um, but like a lower pile, so it's about a quarter inch and I paid $20 for this meter. That's everything I got from Sheer Perfection Fabrics. I will link these all below. Let me know in the comments what your favorite fabric was. So thanks so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video and you're, it's encouraging you to go check out Sheer Perfection Fabrics and I will leave all their links in the description box below. I love if you would subscribe. Did you know that about 85% of my viewers are non-subscribers? So if you are watching this and you are not a subscriber, and you've watched to this point to the end you're sticking around for something so please hit that subscribe button it would really really help me out i am almost at 200 subscribers and i am so excited to get to that point so please hit that subscribe button and you can say in the future that you were one of my first 200 subscribers see you next time